Hey guys, so if you click on this video, you're about to build up your knowledge regarding Sova's high skill cap utility. I'll be starting off showing you three tips for both Sova Drone and Sova All. Then I will go into the juicy general first phase, wall bang, retake and stall lineups. Then double chalk lineups. On each map, starting from best worst best being a sand icebox bind and haven and that enjoy okay guys so plus tips regarding solo drone tip number one the right higher here. the elevation you are the higher up the drone will go tip number two which is to hold down space flight. bar to keep a high elevation and tip number three a drone ain't cheap, so don't let the enemies break it, so we can attack the enemies twice. Now, on to the Hunter's Fury. So, first tip is to run back after tagging someone, then ulting. This will just make it much easier to hit, as the angle you need to move while, well, he runs away is reduced by a lot. Now, second tip is to do this technique as shown here, where you just need to aim a bit down, then where you're intending to aim, then flicking up. Listen, I think this which this kill. reduces the time I for the enemies to do react. It, like that. it actually looks so cool when you watch it it's instantly, and they already took advantage of it. Oh, oh wow. my god! And the third tip is to deploy your ult, preferably to one of these situations or spots. Feel free to pause. Okay guys, so starting off with a send inside defense. Revealing area. First one, pretty easy, just lands there. And the key thing about this lineup is you can combo with Rishok Dart. Right here. Lineup that lands about there next to the orb. Which is very good. Right here. Now, um, another one is this one right here. You just want to tap it and aim it back. Scanning ahead. Like. Now this one is very good if you want to combo it right with here. a fast ult start if of course it tags someone. Very good, it works 100% of the time and well, it also lands for uh, top mid. Now this one what you do is get into that spot, aim at that in white, like white incision. And you just full charge, one bounce. Scanning ahead. This lands just about there and you have a 270 degree, 270 degree lineup which is very good tags literally every spot like just incredible now onto this one what you want to do is get to this table corner and aim just to right of that like I don't know what you call it you just want to two charge that and it beautifully lands there one of the best lineups and also um, tags rotate as well now onto this one and this one is a across map lineup this one get the dash scanning ahead and in full charge one bounce this could be used for then like going flank from mid so yeah very good now this could be done the same but for the opposite side Get that corner and be sure area. Be aiming at that exact point because this could end up badly if you aim it just by a very small bit. So watch out. <laughs> this one is scanning a head charge at the like chimney. And you have a beautiful line. Very simple and could be used as a revealing area. So this one you want to aim at this second giraffe's and it takes sure. Now to the skull scanning lineups. ahead. This one lands there and prioritizes um, the left lane. Which is very very good because that lane is of course more going into. So yeah. 
scanning this ahead. One, what you want to do is aim at that small antenna and jump. So yeah, it's very good because it's very hard to flick that, especially because it's coming in pretty fast. So you got a tie for sure. Again, what you want to do is that scanning ahead. But here, there's a uh, other one, and just aim at that thing. Scanning ahead. So this one is a stall line for E side, which could be also used as a wall bank. Very good, very simple, and scanning it's a ahead. pretty good angle because it also catches rotate. Rather than just revealing area. So this one, what you want to do is to go to that spot right there and aim it ahead. just under that top metal part. And this one, we have wall bank spots coming up next. So just want to double bounce, full charge, add that exact spot, and cut yourself a very good wall bank spot. This could be done reverse. Like literally it's exact same. Here. Now this one, of course, you should jump, and be sure you're not like shooting at a place where it's not wall angle, because it's pretty close to being not. So yeah, and it dies beautifully. A lot of spots, not just for wall banks, and there are basically three spots you can wall bank. Now, on to this one. Now, this is a very unknown lineup I made myself. Just want to get to that spot and full charge, one bounce. Then, wall bank that spot right there, which a lot of people like to say. And this as well. Of course, will be done reversed. Just make sure you add the right angle. So make sure, like, of course, you practice these. Now onto this one. These are five different, like, quote unquote, simple lineups you can do to um, perform wall bangs on the main. As you can see, they're pretty simple, you know. Besides the last one, um, but. Yeah, they're all alternatives to easy kills. <laughs> or no one coming to me, so you can like take it by yourself. Uh, yeah, again, very good. And this could be comboed with um, a guy pushing because it's, it takes a long time to land. Now, onto the proper lineup. So, what you want to do is aim. On top of that like metal machine construction thingy and half charge it it's very simple takes main and mid now to retake one it's very simple you just put it there right and here. well right it tags a right lot here. of the spots so yeah right here of course can be done reverse and it is very good for wall bangs of course um, uh, I did repeat it but um, yeah uh, all these lineups what you want to do is get to that corner and put it into that hot line two and a half charge it then in there one charge Both arrows together will look something like this. Make sure to practice these, these guys, you will forget them very quickly. So, yeah. With the barrier. And that's the aim spot. Just half charge. Then find those four spots and half charge it both arrows together would look something like this now to post plan lineups which one you just get that door find that spot in the clouds 
and half charge that. For hours, you just want to go down and just press it. Both hours together will look something like this. Simple and easy to pick as well. So now onto that one that I just said. Uh, if you want to use very simple, honestly, two charge that, go down, practice the timing and just half charge it. It's very good lens exactly on time and we get probably two kills per round if well they come. So yeah, <laughs> again, what you want to do is get to that corner and just left two charge, go down, practice the timing very well and just shoot it lands perfectly for killing a sniper or a people rotating to it. Now what you want to do is just get to the corner, the uh, spot you want to focus on is there. I'll Scanning it ahead. And it lands perfectly between window and aiming at side. It also ends for a long. So now this one what you want to do is half charge it and jump. Scanning ahead. Very good at 270 degree angle. And uh, yeah, just amazing. So now two uh, different lineups that you can do Scanning for ahead. the main defense. Very simple. This one you just gotta it out. Uh, yeah. Scanning ahead. Now onto a retake one. It's pretty easy. Make sure you aim a bit out. Scanning so ahead. You know? <laughs> and it has a very amazing view, you just watch out for those spots basically. Besides that, a few right here. Tag. Right here. Um, and yeah, just right smoke here. that shit and well, we got a few uh, defuse. On to a slow one, just went to him there. Preferably upper is better. Revealing area. Uh, well, it works like a charm. So now what you want to do is go to that wire. Standing ahead. That yellow flag. Song. This lands perfectly to window. Right here. And right here. Main. Mid main. Revealing area. Oh, these are some retake. Standing so, ahead. This one is very good. It shows both in and out. Now, what do you see defense? What you want to do? Let's see, just Revealing area. Place it there and shoot. Half charge, of course, and it lands perfectly for both spots that are very important. Now, this one. Make sure that it lines perfectly. And Revealing area. Amounts. The upper, that like spot goes there. Now, this one, what you want to do is crouch and shoot into that. Scanning ahead. There. And for the last one, finally got you take okay. it to Sinatra. So you just have to put the top of this line, fuck the top of that line right there, just r like right in the middle of this, but just a tiny bit to the right of it, you know, like that. Revealing area. I think that should land on the side. Okay, now onto a wallbang spot that. Um, um, current thieves use. Right here. Very good. It doesn't require so well, but yet again, it's very like simple. Yeah, it's very deadly. Just right be here. careful that um, you don't do what <laughs> this pro did right here because, well, it was an epic fail. It's so funny, but. Yeah, he's feeling the blood. <laughs> yeah, it's In the air. Man, it can be the thing to stop it. Just spams away, buddy. Is that you? And now he's going to carry on forward. He still wants to try and close that gap, try to get in their faces. He's not going to stop anymore. It's absolute mayhem. And CNN is trying to thrive in it. He goes still stands though. But the defuse is coming in. Wait, the spray! Oh my god. Are we really seeing this right now? There's nothing they can do. Oh my god. The lockdown as well will confirm it. Oh. We'll get detained here. Look at his, he's not even got his hand on the keyboard. And maybe he should, no, he doesn't need no it. No way, man. Stop it, Steel. Get him out of the game. This is <laughs> unthinkable. He's a the
Yeah, so which I'll get, which I'll get. What am I watching? I'm just gonna just deploy your recon. I think that yellow spot right there, and just aim wherever the player is. That's as simple as that. It's a pretty good one, and a nice action. So, what you want is hold crouch, aim at that place, and one charge that. Then, aim at that light bulb, and shoot instantly. The door should look like this. If the spike spawns in that spot, aim just between those little leaves, crouch of course, and two charge. Then go down and aim there. One charge and you guys line up. Boat will look like this. For default day in defense. You want to go to that corner, look at those dark edges, and half charge. Then drag down, and make sure that the charge bar touches that bulb, and shoot it. This lineup would look like this. Planting default C. Uh, Go into that corner, put the line under that wooden slab, full charge. Make sure your charge bar gets into under that roof corner and shoot it, but not like pressing it only. Bow will look like this. Perfect. So, A behind box, look at the bottom right of that window, and two charge. Then, track down, under, it is there, and half charge. This is very good for pistol and eco rounds. Now, bind, which one you? It's just full charge and aim low. Very simple, yet I do this all the fucking time. Scanning ahead. Uh, well, of course I fucking charge, so please use it. Please. Unless you're against me, then don't, because it's annoying. <laughs> now what you want to do is go there. And two charge that shit is very Revealing great. area. As you can see here, because it aims into all the cubbies in the site and where the enemy team will peek the window and long so yes very good indeed now what you want to do is aim a bit lower Revealing and press it one bounce and it lands perfectly into three spots where, where if they're pushing b then they're of course in so yeah now this one just full charge at the highest point possible Make sure that you're going to because ahead. then well your teammates will flame me so fucking bad but well if it works then you got free side basically because it's so OP. Now this one's a stall. Um just a revealing it like this and it lands for both uh, rotate and if they're pushing the um, throw. So now this one get into that position right there, aim at the sun. Half charge it and it will Revealing be area. There for a retake arrow. Now, this one, what you want to do is just to charge it at that Revealing spot. area. It doesn't have to be exactly there, but well, it's better. And the beautiful thing about this is because they can run away if they're in that far. Now this one just full charge and standing ahead that solar panel. It's very simple, yeah it checks 270 degrees of the entire site and well it's very OP. So now this one is a smaller room. Scanning which, ahead. Um attacks both lab 
and the rotate so it's very good Scanning this ahead. one is very good with a tax board cubby and box now this one is a wall bank lineup so aim there and right just here. press it it's very good just make sure that your back is Scanning facing ahead. the box um, and then just get into that spot and start fucking spraying and praying it's very good just make sure that they don't push you because then will you can run away as you nod it again just press that Standing ahead. and shoot it now this one is for the reverse This would land there, and the best thing is it checks that spot for a potential wall bank. So again, what you want to do is just aim there then, and be careful that you're aiming that spot where it's unwall bankable, as you can see here. So aim it where like. It's softer, or else just pl just uh, place a ping because it's much better than like being up my knees. Right here. So just after that spot right there, and well, you got you, you got a free kill basically, or else it's stuck. So. Plus, that's another potential one. Now this one is a uh, woman for your teammates, you just want to like, shoot it literally and well your, your teammates should do the rest. It's very impossible for them to like just um, flick and kill the uh, lineup without well getting attacked once at least so your teammates will actually have a free kill. Now this one is for retake arrow and it lands beautifully there. The best thing about this is well that you can wallbang it very easily just not that corner which well sometimes they play it but well you still have some pretty good value right here right here so make sure that you aim there as that will count obviously and this is what we will look like. Very simple, just for shot ammo. So shot arrows that will kill having B default. First arrow, just aim at that middle and double charge. For second arrow, just aim at the left hand line there and half charge. More arrows together will look like this. So this is the picking a short, walk in that corner right there, put the ball in the left mouse icon, just there, and you have to charge. For second row, put the left hand line there, and half charge it. Both arrows together will look like this. And this is very hard to see them coming. Now onto a postman lineup. We have two more charge. You just aim up from that bit. And you just press it. Our arrows will look like this. Now for the B side, postman. Walk into that corner. Put the left drone circle onto that part and do half power charge. And put that mouse icon there, middle, and just press it. So put that left drone logo there. Two and a half power charge. Then put the letter A there 
as you can see and this is second bar charge for arrows would look like this and it's very hard to see them coming on twice box first lineup would look like this so just two bounces and then it's like standing ahead it's very good because it uh, tags both entries and they can't really run from it or hide from it so well you got yourself a very simple tag now this one is used for also potential wall bang but it's pretty harder than this scanning ahead with our, which are intended for like just wall bangs only uh, as you can see though it tags run 70 degrees so yeah. now this one is a very good push arrow for attack scanning ahead well, it has actually multiple pur purposes. Now, this one is for a revealing sword, area. A dark arrow. And it lands like a charm for rope. Now, this one is also a stall, but it's farther back if you put in a revealing area for a uh, shock. And it lands there. Now, this one is also a push arrow. It's very easy. Yeah, ahead. It takes a lot of entry points. That's what we see. Now this one which you can do is aim a bit up of that metal part which is a bit upper than the rest. Revealing area. Aim it as up as possible and then you have a two-way lineup which are both equally as important. Now this one what you want to do is you take one, it's very simple, just get to that point right there and aim at that like white spot in the middle of it. Boom. One bounce, full charge, and Standing ahead. there. This is very easy to get a literally five, five man tag because, well, of course, they have to be there unless they're like flanking mid or something. So, yeah. Now, this is a harder version of that. Standing ahead. You get that corner and aim up charge. Same thing, just farther back, maybe mostly like just to help the teammates out if you like very far. And now, this one is a uh, right start of round one what you want to do is just half charging and then it's there and it's very ahead. good if you want to combo it with that shock lineup which i'll show you later it's very good now this one is a wall bank slash wall close lineup per se uh, it's very good because it tags the shit anyone who's on uh the zip line as well so yeah right very good and you have yourself ahead. a very like safe lineup like very safe because well there are like people can push up and it could have been kept used as well very deadly ahead. and this one's very good because it attacks tubes so it's one of the better ones to pursue with but it's also good for wall banks of course as, can, as you can see here pretty safe so. Now this one is very deadly one. Um, just last there, two bounce it doesn't matter as much. Get to that elevating spot right there, crouch, and you have yourself full control of tubes. No need for save well. And yeah, you can get yourself to close to the tubes 100%. Just remember that elevation for safety purposes. And well, yeah. So now for shock lineups, aim at that star, then two bounce, full charge. Now for a second, look up in that corner, just under that block line. And aim for two charge. Both will look like this. These shocks will kill the players and will get yourself a 3k right there. So look at this square just about that, like 
air conditioning system or whatever and tune balance then front is right after aim the middle of it fast two bounce one tap and with a bit of practice it will look like this very perfect indeed practice this one because well yeah now this one is for orb look up at that star and put it on the right tip of that um, charge icon and do a uh, two charge then track down where the tip of the chalk dart is just about there and two charge use these shots in sort of rounds to predict a P push The shocks will prevent the player planting. So go in that corner. Look at that shape. At that particular point. And double charge. And just aim at sitting right under that place. One bounce, full charge. These aren't exactly synchronized, but together they will look like this. So for the first shock dart, aim that star on top of it, one bounce, two charge. For the second one, just aim at the fourth right arrow, one bounce, half charge. Both arrows will look like this. Very good, you can of course time with a peak as well. So for this lineup, what you want to do is right aim here. to charge uh, on top of that. Revealing area. And watch us two lanes. Now with some of this update, what you want to do is just wall bang that corner. Right because, here. Because, well, it's a potential angle for sure. But it's no way. Now, this one, what you want to do is double bounce in that corner right there. And Standing that ahead. is a very easy to learn line for mid. And this one is retake arrow for a side. Revealing double area. bounce at full charge. And you have yourself a very good lineup. Standing ahead. Just stall one. Where I just want you to do that and go. Now this one full charges and well, you have yourself Revealing a area. quick and easy uh, first phase lineup. And uh, you can see three spots for potential lines. Now this one just one bounce it and revealing area there and let's brief there. No player literally not yet tagged besides the one that potentially is behind the box close and revealing the area star. so the solar would check both uh, tubes and uh, the rotate over and the revealing area this one is here which is basically a transistor to view for a lot of potential uh, post plan spots that the attacker should be in This one is a wall bank spot. Preferably, you will use uh, Sheriff because it just run the right amount of range for it to still hit it. One shot with a deagle, if it's headshot, of course. So, yes, very good. Now, this one, it's a retake arrow from another spot, or could be used as well for uh, pushing from mid. Do as you please. And it tags much spots and it tags these locks right here. You can of course wall bind these like a charm. And this retake arrow. And as well as a defense arrow. So it tags beautifully a lot of spots. 
but best thing is if especially it's a guy planting for default, just wall bank. Of course, watch out for the push. So if they're holding from graffiti, go in this corner. Look at these leaves above. And put the right vertical line about there. And do a full charge. Now drag down and aim so that left diamond aims there. Then do one bounce to charge. Use these shocks in the third round to land both shocks at the same time. And make sure to wait a bit so it lands perfectly in time, both of them. And works like a charm. Now this one is for default plan. Aim just a bit above the box. And do one bounce, full charge. Then turn back and aim at this corner of this brick. And two bounce, full charge. And make sure when you do it, just wait a bit again. But trust me, it's very good. So if you're coming from B, hug that wall and aim with that pipe at that HUD line and then just two charge it and then for the second part one uh, aim there and one bounce will charge and of course make sure that middle is clear because you don't want to fly with your um, bow out you know <laughs> And it works like a charm, it's very beautiful, just make sure that you time it right, of course. And this one is for main entrance. Hug this wall. And wait until the dark line overlaps with this wall right there. Okay. Now then look at this dark corner. One charge and jump. For a second one, just aim at this cross as could be seen here. And one bound, two bounds actually full charge. And of course, uh, for the time together, use the second shots a bit late. So, love between the rock and the box. And um, at the leaf of the right. With the diamond top of it. And two bounce, one bounce, two charge. Then turn, crouch, and look at this. Then two bounce, full charge. Make sure that um, you place it perfectly because, well, it's easy to mess up this one. For, for practice, it will look like this. And it's a very easy one for them to miss, especially the second line of this line so fast. Now to split. So this one is very easy area. to learn. Uh, well, of course, like a charm. Now a uh, second version of this which could be compared with uh, either, not compared, paired with either an off right here. or a uh, double shock lineup. Scanning ahead. And 
this of course also lands for water Now for the attack version of this one, what we're gonna do is aim standing ahead there on top of the boxes of course and give yourself a very good line which packs most of the spots they'll be close. Just of course watch outside. Now this one is for B and aim under that one bounce full charge. Revealing area. It is very good, of course. Now this one is for uh, heaven. Aim just under that arrow on your left side, and it's a full charge on mount. Scanning ahead. This will take a long time to land, but it's actually pretty good that it does that because well, you have time for you to rotate perfectly on the mid, and then you do the execute from mid to me. Now this one is very good if you want to combo with, with uh, Bolt, so just aim just a bit above where I'm aiming right here, and 2 bounce, full charge, land on this land Scanning here, ahead. and go, yes, I'm going to follow to, as can be seen. Revealing area. I am the hunter! Feeling area. Uh, view. So, yeah, you practically tagging everyone besides, well, a guy who's of course doing the lineup or besides that box. And this one right. is wall bank spot. It's very good because it's both wall bank and uh, uh, just a very good lineup in general because it, uh, of course, tags um, most of the entry points. And this one is a retake arrow, which works like a charm. You can use as a wall bank spot, but preferably, I mean, honestly, like, um, it is uh, prioritizing the retake arrow than the wall bank. So, yeah, this is the view. And well, it's just beautiful, like, one for the retake. Now, this one is for mid upper. What you want to do is just. Get him to this, have an Aries or anything with high penetration, and just aim. Make sure that he doesn't counter you. If he has an orb, then just start raising the altar. And yeah, you get a pistol with three, one by kill. Now, this one is for wall banging the uh, um, behind of that box. Revealing area. It's very simple, you can combo with a player. One is the opposite of that, and the very good thing is about this one is that it's a very uh, long lane, and besides that, well, it tags anyone who is taking an orb, meaning you have yourself free info, <laughs> and well, yeah, it's very good. So, for shock darts, what you want to do? Same, just and like gap. Do a half charge and lands there. And another shot dart is just, just crouch, two bounce, and aim at that highest point right there. And this does the exact same thing. So you can come with this, of course, and it will look something like this. It works like a charm. Now this, everyone knows it. And it's two, two bounces, full charge. Now if someone's chilling in that corner, what you want to do is go under that B. Now aim at that pipe, like so. And do a full charge. For the first shock. And then move back. And aim underneath that line. Two bounce. Two charge. Together we look like this. And of course it's not a second 
not just walking through the wall and a madame work just under a seven do one bounce two charge and this goes up the wall and lands there now for the second shot just move a bit to the right two bounce full charge when you combine you can of course double shoulder this and well yeah <laughs> you destroy your enemy team to shock bone from that position just aim at that grey edge and just press it now for fracture um, it's a very good lineup uh, for first phase scanning so, ahead looks like charm you can't hide from it and yes it's very good now this is a very controlled lineup so what you're gonna do is aim there scanning and ahead just all drone it works like and you have control of a very important side of the map so yeah now this one is a attack arrow just half charge it that's fine scanning ahead and this watch is uh, just two barra area and first side now this wall bay lineup just one bounce full charges it lands there very fast you gotta tag off for sure and just run here and just shoot it's very good to make sure that they don't counter you but yeah it's so OP. Now this one is really simple, you just half charge it. That's what revealing and area. It works there. And this is a retake arrow, so just aim a bit above that yellow line. And scanning ahead. You got yourself a very nice line. So this one of course just one pass it. Revealing like so. area. Compare it with a wall bang or anything you want basically. It's very good though because you don't pee. And I see a lot of solar Scanning ahead. Spot. So just don't do it and do this. <laughs> now this one just came a bit of below the camera. One bounce. Scanning ahead. And yourself a very good line up. Choose both heaven and side like a charm for the retake. Uh, a stall rope on the other hand it looks something like this it's very, Revealing good. Area. It's very good so this one is a uh, wallman club which also um, can do it for two spots actually so heaven and that spot right there which is actually uh, pretty used in the high ranks so yeah, plus it was stairs. Now this one just full charge, one bounce. And preferably anywhere shadow because it's pretty easy to die. If like a jet pushes you or some shit. So yeah, but uh, it's pretty good if you want to go back as well. The wall bang is just a plus. And this one is pretty uh, 200 IQ one. Just jump, half charge. And uh, you can actually use it as wall bang because it's on the edge. So make sure you practice it, but uh, well, if you do, give yourself a free kill. If um, the enemy is on it, or I don't know, just taking risks. Alright, so um, he's dead. <laughs> now uh, for postman, for first arrow, just aim at this circle and do a uh, half charge. For the second row, just aim the left edge of the charge bar and just tap it. Together they will look like this. And obviously if you're using this practically dead, so now just uh some shots for orb. Aim at the edge of the wall, aim at that vertical line, and do a half charge. For a second arrow, 
put it in the middle and just stop it. Boat will look like this. So this also would be okay. Go to this corner. This is the top right edge on that corner. And do a half charge on balance. For a second row, place the left there and just tap it. The boat will look like this. So you want to walk to canteen and stand on the middle lots. So for the first row, aim right there, half charge. For a second row, and the charge bar in that corner, and do a one bounce for the charge. Both arrows look like this. And the final one, like one spot, he's dead. So, for this one, for, uh, for first row, you want to aim that charge bar line there and do a half charge. For the second arrow, Go to the left edge of the charge bar and just tap it. And that is it guys. I hope this helped a lot. What I request in return is uh, just a comment for you saying that it helped out. Make sure that, that like you contribute these into your rank games because well they do help. So, and besides all of that, it's B3 FPS and I am out. Peace.